What's going on guys? I'm back and we're gonna be moving onward and I'm gonna try not to hit this desk because I don't know how loud that'll be. But, uh, obviously I'm back with Fantasy Star Zero. I actually called it the right name that time. I guess we're gonna head up and see where that goes. I was messing with the audio. Oh! Rab Rappy. <laughs> I have to hit myself to hit these. No! Okay, well, with Rappies, you have to hit them because they get up and they run. I think I hit him. I think I hit him. There's more! Ugh. Okay, I'm gonna watch this one. You guys fumble around with those. And maybe I can hit this guy before he gets up. And then we can do the same. You feel me? I don't know which one they hit first. Gotta look for movement. They didn't get the other one. This is too much. Were they supposed to be in this room, or was it other enemies? Like, That's like two rares in a run. Ooh, and a red box. Mine material? Good thing I don't need that. <laughs> That's one thing I miss about uh, just Fantasy Star in general, is finding a red box. Like, it's rare, you know? And it, it looks different. It's something you don't see that often. Oh my goodness. Is that all they drop is photon drops? Speaking of... Maybe I'll go use those in a little bit, but uh... Give me that heal. Uh, okay. She heal Ogi. She do not want me. Uh, if I remember correctly, you can use the photon drops in that little sewer shop area. So, maybe we'll go there and see what we can find. They're usually just gag gifts. Gag gifts, yep. Yeah. Gag weapons, like I think I bought that flower pot or whatever it was. Okay, now that you're here with us... Although, those things are tempting. Come over here, guys. Let's see, I think that'll still hit them. Oh, you can go way around. Kai is dead. He got gang kicked. I'm a terrible teammate. Just letting them get slaughtered. Oh my goodness. Uh, Ogi, did you... Help. There's one, yeah, one, oh my god. I didn't, I don't remember him doing that. I'm, I'm a shooting. He a teleporting. Boy. Time to go around. I'm not getting those lasers shot on me. He's, he's kicking butt. He's not even taking their names, he's just kicking butt. Have I leveled up twice since... Because didn't I level last time? The last, uh... I didn't acknowledge it, but I'm pretty sure I leveled. Alright. Let's feed this guy. You know, I'm okay with that. Just move, bringing the guard back down. Need to go buy more diamates. But when we go back to town, I will um, sell the stuff and, uh, you know, whatever. Sell the stuff, go check out that uh, sewer shop. All right, some story. 
Huff, pant. I knew it wouldn't be easy, but this is harder than I'd imagined. Yeah, I guess there's a lot of stairs. Well, we are headed into the lion's den. Mother Trinity doesn't want us here, and she's making that quite clear. If you weren't here with us, Kai, we'd never have made it this far. <laughs> Enough with the flattery. It's kind of creepy coming from you. I'm simply being frank. We cast don't waste time with the insinuation and petty semantics you humans use. Now you've gone from being frank to being blunt, Ogie. I wonder if Anna's... Is it Anna? Anna? I'm gonna go with Anna. If Anna's alright, I'd be a lot less worried if we could reach her by radio. Is Anna... Read me? Anna, can you hear me? Are you alright, Anna? Oh, good. You... Alright. You are looking bad, but promise we... It... Anna? Anna, I can't hear you! Sir, we take much more. No, they more reinforcement behind. They're coming from behind. Anna, come in, Anna. Oh, Anna. It sounds pretty bad. Maybe I should have gone with her instead. Have some faith. You're right. She's still fighting, and she's not alone out there. There's still hope. See, I wonder if Kai would have actually went with her. Like, I know my choices, or I've heard my choices make a difference. Right. In the meantime, we need to focus on our own task. Like, what if I don't go help her? Is she gonna die, like, sacrifice herself to save us? Or, like, if I send, or say Kai should have went, then he'd help her, or we'd lose both? I don't know. I have never been this far. Wow. In the short time I was away, you guys grew up to be bona fide hunters, didn't you? It's too late to turn back now, so let's push on, full speed ahead. Oh! <laughs> I guess we're, we're at the boss. Boss man. Routine report. Six rejected advice. Rejected, rejected, all rejected, all! Oh boy. I don't like the look of that. Um, let's then use a telepipe, because I don't know what's past this. I love that I have just readily available telepipes. And there I go doing that. He probably sees the future and sees that this is not going to go well. So... What don't I need? I don't need trap vision. I'm a cast. They don't use trap vision. Um. Hmm. It's good against native. Really, at this point, I only want stuff that's good against dark. But if it's stronger than what I got, which it shouldn't be because I boosted mine. I'll keep that because of the accuracy adjustment. That's not bad. That's different. We'll uh we'll keep it. That's my thing that I've had. Hmm, good against machine. I'll keep that too. Yeah, I'll keep that. And that's my gun, Dark Rexus. Sounds kinda cool. Slow Bergman, I can't even use. Iron Rocket, I can't use. These things. I'll put all those away. Shield Rope. Look at all that. I need to find a good armor. Alright, let's put a couple of those away, because I don't think I'm going to use them. And we'll go see what's going on in the shop. I don't think I'm going to be using those anyway. I'm not so sure about this. It is stronger than what I... No, it's not. Why did I even keep it? Um, we got them photon drops. Oh my god. Is 
So, should have 52 now. We'll go sell that Dark Rexus, because I don't need it. And we'll go see what's going on. I don't know how to get there now. It's down this way, ain't it? Ain't it? Is that another cat? Chai. Here we go. Was was that guy there before? Was that girl there before? There are cats everywhere. Photon drop trade. Twinkle Star. I remember that, I think. What kind of, um... See, they don't have any, like, elemental boosts, though. That's... That's what I'd be after. I will always read this as Grow Shower. Like, are you a shower or a grower? Um... But I'm sure it's Grow Shower. Like, because it's a... You know... Uh, a watering can. Caracasa Jacomi. I don't know what that is. Berry Ice Beam. Witch Broom, Dumbbell, Mag. You can just buy a mag. Escape Doll, Stun Element. So you could add these, I suppose, to your items. I ain't feeling that, though. I don't think it was worth it to bring my uh, things with me. What's this guy got? Oh, he's a synthesizer. Okay. All right. Password machine. I don't know any passwords. Do you guys know any passwords? Because I don't. Do my photon drops count towards my... Uh... No, they don't count towards my number of items. I might as well keep them on me. Maybe the special items don't count? I... I do think I'm going to put them all away, though. Keep those grinders, because I'll use them on my thing. Um, um, what am I doing? I was going to say, I'd like to come back when I'm, like, level 30 to do the rest of this. But... I feel like I'm pretty good, you know? Oh, I didn't buy anything. I think I just sold stuff. So let's use this real quick. Sure. Okay. Because I'm a fan of that saber. Let us buy more diamates. Monomates. I'm I'm still afraid to buy trimates, man. They cost way too much. Okay. I wish I could hold more dimates though. All right. Let's see what this is, man. It could be a boss, could be a mini boss, just could be whatever. Who knows? Leroy! This place is certainly different. Are we here? Is this it? Yes. I would bid you welcome. Were you welcome here? So Mother Trinity finally shows herself. Oh boy! That's a creepy woman. Is that her? That's her. It matches the images from my sub-memory. I am impressed you made it this far. You should feel proud. You are the first of all mankind to come here. I'm gonna go with it was a bit of a challenge. A bit, you say? My, my. few halls worth of robotic drones can compare to the struggle of living on the surface these last 200 years. Ah, yes, how brave. But I warn you not to forget this. You have arrived here at this spot not through skill or tenacity or luck. 
You are here because I have allowed it. Hmm. <laughs> Self-centered as ever. Mother Trinity, I have just one question I want to ask. Of course. It seems only fair after your struggle to get here. You were a computer built to help mankind. Why hurt them instead? What happened? Such a trivial matter. I simply executed the optimal solution to the problem I was given. It just so happened that the solution involved the obliteration of mankind. I don't understand. How could destroying the planet be the best way to help people? You misunderstand my task. I was not created to help mankind as you suggest. I was made to repair the ailing environment. Mankind was a detail of little consequence in that equation. In fact, it was they who tarnished their own world, consuming its resources with no thought of the repercussions. I feel like we could use her now, except, you know, the killing thing. They quibbled amongst themselves, scarring the land with their pointless wars and quests for progress. It was all quite unforgivable. It quickly became apparent that the only way to restore the environment would be to begin anew from scratch. Provided a small sample of mankind survived, thinning the herds and putting the priority on reclamation made sense. And so I took the appropriate actions. As predicted, a handful of your persistent ilk lived on just the same. Like Hub, Ogi, and me! Yes, the pond scum eventually floated back up to the surface. Honestly, I cannot understand it. Why bother to fight for such meager lives? Why question my authority? The planet's welfare is assured as long as it remains in my care. All life but mine is easily replaceable. Replaceable? Surely you are aware to whom you owe your existence, Newman. Aware that it was my hand that brought your kind back to their current numbers. Were you really so naive as to believe that you were part of nature? That your life was anything but artificial? That is almost too clumsy to laugh at. So you engineered us? You built us from scratch in some lab? Don't be silly. The Newmans I created lived a century ago. You are merely their offspring. It had always been my plan to rebuild the human and caste races as well once the environment was again stable. But it seems no amount of education can rectify your destructive ways. It pains me deeply to see the Newmans fail to understand such obvious truths. Look, that's a great speech and all, but can we get on with this? Or did you want something else for your headstone? My, my, turning to violence now? Even against me? Your creator? Your god? Your mother? You're no god and you're no mother of mine. What kind of mother would kill her own children? Mother Trinity, for what you did to the cast and for the sake of all mankind, I'll see your days end here and now. How amusing. How positively droll. The very idea that you should ever think such a thing even possible. This one's actually pretty tough. Well, still so cocksure after tasting the same photon eraser that rained down righteous fire centuries ago? Have you learned your place? Surely you see that you have yet to touch me while a lot of you lie there smoldering on the ground. We're not through with you yet. Abysmally slow learners, I see. Then allow me to offer up a follow-up lesson. I read that wrong. Here's a charming fact. The bolt that struck you just now took less energy than flexing my pinky. It was tantamount to a gentle stroke. No way. She's a monster. Such lovely expressions. 
just at the cusp of losing all hope and embracing despair. I won't lie, it's actually quite amusing. I'm thoroughly satisfied by our little exchange, completely satisfied, and ready, now, to move on. I think that is more than enough idle banter for one day. Shall we end this now? Ugh. My body's not listening. Uh, I mean, I feel like they're the same thing, but I'd probably do this one. My, my, how utterly senseless. I'm surprised to see you bother to stand, having seen the futility of struggling. Hub! Your persistence is bothersome. The same was true of your kind 200 years ago. A single upstart cast rallied all of mankind in a fruitless crusade against their greatest benefactor. I will admit, it proved to be a bit of a challenge. I was victorious in the end, however. Call it natural order. Still, I cannot fathom man's persistent drive to do what he knows full well is an impossible waste of time. It's not a waste. Strange. I feel as though I've seen that defiant look somewhere before. I have a feeling I'm that cast. No. No, it's impossible. What's happening? That same detestable face. Was the cast stasis merely a form of temporary hibernation? I knew the possibility existed, but to think it would survive. That vile cast caused me more woes than anything else in my history, and faces me even after losing all memory? Of course. That explains what we saw in the ruins, your likeness in the moving images. This affront is unforgivable. How dare you show that face to me now, 200 years after you ought to have died? She big man. That light, look out, she's using the photon eraser. This is forever the case with mankind, isn't it? They grow drunk on what little power they have and baldly disobey their own gods. They add insult to injury by decrying me as incompetent, then move to strike me down by force. Even now, still, you will learn. You will repent your foolish ways and know that even now, 200 years later, trash remains trash. Hub, run! My patience for man's petulance ends here. Feel the full brunt of my power and be gone! What? Why isn't... No, it's not possible. She's not drawing energy. What happened? You hear? Come in. Hub, Sarisa, answer if you can hear me. Anna, you're okay. Yeah, somehow. And we just now took down her energy source. That should put her on a short leash. Uh, this one. You'll be fine. We'll all be fine now. We have each other and more allies than I ever knew. Impossible. That facility was guarded with enough sentinels to repel the entire Newman race if necessary. Oh, snap, it's Dyron. Dyron City. What did I call it? I don't know. Ah, but you forget, Mayor Mother Mayor Moo Moo. Mother Trinity, you aren't up against the Newmans. You're up against all mankind. What? That's... Now there's a voice I wasn't expecting to hear up here. Good day, everyone. Anna here filled me in on all the details. It's nice to know exactly who we're up against. Wait, even the mayor's here? I threw a word in there why I do. A whole army of them came from the surface. Humans and castes and... No, this isn't about race. It's about the family of mankind. Our family showed up to help us fight. Mayor, I'm surprised to see you made it here. We haven't been able to contact you at all to report our progress. Oh, I heard all about your travails. From our sour-faced guide here. What guide? Hmph. Reeve! Figures it was you. Looks like you finally figured out who the real threat was here. Don't misunderstand, Mabadoobadoo. I can't read, dude. Woo! Don't misunderstand me. I didn't do this for your people's sake. 
If I wanted Mother Trinity gone, the neutrino furnace had to go first. It was a matter of pragmatics. I know, Reeve, but still, that adds up to you saving us. So thanks. You really are soft. Something as simple as this, and you're already thanking a man who was your bitter foe until now? But then, I suppose your strength lies in that as well. It chafes me to give the honors to someone else, but I leave ending Mother Trinity to you. So get up and fight already. Show us all how fantastic this teamwork you love to practice on about is. Prattle on. <sighs> this episode's gone on a while, and I just, I'm not able to read. <laughs> yes, yes. You fought hard to give us this opportunity. We're not going to let it go to waste. Sarisa is right. We all must pull our weight. He's letting us do the fun stuff. Let's pull out all the stops. No! Impossible, impossible, impossible! No mortal should be able to stand after taking the brunt of the photon eraser. Uh, let's see. I'll fight to save mankind. Hope for the future is all we really need to go on living. We won't allow you to deny us that deliverance. Now do it, Hub! Strike her down and pave the way to that future! I don't remember what his voice was, so that's what he gets. Preposterous! The only being this world needs is me! It's God! Nothing more, nothing more, nothing more! Be gone, humans! Be gone, cast! Be gone, Newmans! This world holds no place for your kind. Prepare to embrace your extinction! I hope I get to walk through another portal. Oh no, it's happening. Okay, hold on. I... I have to pause this. I'm pausing? And I'm saving, and uh, we're coming back uh, in the next one, and it will be the fight and anything that's after that. So, uh, I'm going to record it right after. Maybe I'll upload them both on the same day, or it'll just happen after. I don't know. We'll see what happens when we get to that point. But I will catch you guys in the next one, and I guess it'll be the end of Fantasy Star Zero.